When I saw this tree over there, Oscar Robertson said, I thought, there was where the Dust Bowl was. He stood beneath a tent on the Indiana University, Purdue University, Indianapolis campus on a sunny spring afternoon, pointing to his right toward a tree just beyond a black iron fence. The tree towers over Lockfield Gardens apartment complex, a few feet beyond the northeast section of the IUPY campus, where students have walked to class for years with no idea what stood there and the powerful meaning that spot holds. Robertson was there to change that. He held a large pair of ceremonial scissors to mark the dedication of a campus recreation outdoor facility a few feet from the now grassy location of the old court. Now there are basketball courts with clear backboards and nets and two sand volleyball courts. Soon a plaque commissioned by the university will pay tribute to the historic significance of the spot. The Dust Bowl produced the players that attended Crispus Attucks, a segregated high school that won the 1955 and 1956 Indiana State Basketball Championship. To honor the team and community, Robertson, championship teammate Bill Hampton, Crispus Attucks alum and former Harlem Globetrotter Hallie Bryant, Alumni Board of Officers President Fred Robertson, and many folks from the time attended the dedication beneath the tent and a discussion in a campus auditorium. A former majorette from the Crispus Attucks band stepped to a microphone with a suggestion, can we sing the crazy song? In the final minutes of games, that was the song that announced that victory was near. 